Hello, Stevie here, and we're taking a walk through Garden City on this gorgeous day. Since it's a Thursday, it's not a school day for me. My school days are, are Monday and Wednesday. You can technically say Tuesday and Friday are too, because that's where I have my tutor for math. But today is not. It's a gorgeous day. It's so hot I can wear my tank top. I know I should have put on shorts, but I have sweatpants on. Like really heavy ones, and I don't know why. <laughs> so we're walking through Garden City. Taking a loop through the area. We're actually very close to Roosevelt Field Mall. Initially I was thinking going there to, to the Barnes and Noble in Roosevelt Field to get physics review and workbook and a couple of other things, but I decided instead that I'd write some of my own books. Mm -hmm. well, of course not physics, because that'd be hard for me to do. I mean, I'm thinking of actually writing a science book based off of the Workman book, mm -hmm. based off of, you know, like, the complete survival guide science. Mm -hmm. I really like that book I got. I got it in the Palisades Mall. Mm -hmm. But anyway, it's warm. I'm convinced that maybe in the house I used to live in, my mom's house, I should set up a, set up a pool that has a capacity of two people in it, because that's all I have room for. Set the pool in the backyard in a month from now. In April. Also, Easter is coming, Passover is coming, so my Easter grab bag with trading cards is going to be made soon. Just like what Pokey Order used to sell. Yeah, shame when Pokey ordered. They, they got rid of most of their stock, just like Newegg. So yeah, don't shop there. And also don't shop there, because unlike Newegg, they're unreliable with their sales. They just can't get their items in stock. So yeah, screw you, Pokey Order. There's an M7 on the LRR main line. It's, it's pulling into Mineola. Or it might be a Ronkonkoma train that doesn't stop in Mineola. Those things run express all the way from White, from, from Hicksville to Harlem 25th Street. <laughs> Without any stops in between, not even Jamaica or Woodside. <laughs> I actually took a trip to, to Lindbergh today to get Kenny, Kentucky Fried Chicken. Yes, there is a Kennedy Fried Chicken in Lindbergh as well. I was in the in the north part of Lindbrook today. And then I'm sure that Pine Power Ally and Angie's Randomness would say that that Lindbrook is not nowhere near as nice as the Lindbrook, the real Lindbrook, whereas the Garden City that I'm in now is not much nicer than the real Garden City. Because that Lindbrook I'm talking about is New Rochelle. It's a city. You'll never find a Kennedy fried chicken in an enclave because the rents are too high. You'll never find it here in the real Takahoe or Scarsdale, the real Scarsdale, just north where I'm looking directly at from here. It's not visible, Scarsdale, but you know what I mean. Anyway, my mom's old house. We'll set up the pool that we set up during the pandemic in 2020. Set it up in around a month from now, three weeks, two months from now, it depends on like warming up the water and the weather that goes on. Like if it's too much, if there's another snowstorm, I'll delay. But I doubt there's gonna be more snow because <laughs> the weather it's been recently. I mean, today the equinox hasn't happened yet and it's still warm enough to swim today. <laughs> but the pool wasn't set up in time. And it's too risky because you might see snow. 
in the future. That happened to me in 10th grade once, was that it was warm enough to swim outside before the equinox, meaning you'd be swimming outside in winter. It helps keep you cool down, but it's too bad Pine Paralyte doesn't like cooling down that way. It'd really help him. Yeah. Let's get rid of our garden city. The thing that I was too bad about getting to that pool, unlike getting to Lake Isle right there, it was felt which is very close by, no hills, or hardly any hills, because it's right next to Roosevelt Field. The golf course there is behind Roosevelt Field at that pool. That's easy to get to from my apartment. My mom's house, however, is a walk up a hill, as I've shown in my earlier videos. Getting to my apartment is still a walk up a hill. I'm not going to give any more details. Now we're about to get to this park. A park that's really close to Roosevelt Field. I think it's called Leewood Park in Westchester terms. This is where the LIR main line goes from triple track to double track, right after Mineola. Mineola gets a lot of turning, gets a lot of originators on weekends, and a lot of export, and a lot of Ronkonkoma trains making it as its first or last stop. Between there and the city, because of the three tracks and the work that's being done at Hicksville Station. Right there. I'm talking about the North Hicksville Station. There's a lot of work being done there. It's been done for the past five years. I remember that trains used to. There used to be like semi-express trains originating at Mineola back in 2019. They only made stops to Queens Village and then Woodside, then Parliament 25th Street and Grand Central. And now those local trains make all the stops. Hollis, Jamaica, Kew Gardens, Forest Hills, Woodside, Sunnyside, Harlem 25th Street and Grand Central. There's the park. And also someday these trams will come into this area, this neighborhood. This will be a tight fit. There need to be like crossings for like the halfway tram. Because this is only like room for like one 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 line, one track. I just hope there aren't any dogs here. You know, I'm surprised that Donald Trump doesn't have any dogs. Given how he is politically. But Joe Biden, he has a cat. <laughs> that makes sense. This is the park where I took calculus. Mm -hmm. It was like really windy outside last August and it was just dreadful trying to get through that book really fast. Mm -hmm. There's a nice lake. Mm -hmm. Taking the walk through the park. Bye.